Driving revenue at a hotel starts with the heart of the property, the front line. The front office desk can be a hotel's weakest link or strongest source of sales generation. There are many sales activities that front office can engage in to support a hotel's revenue and overall profitability. Dubai is a highly competitive market with plenty of lodging choices for travelers to choose from. Hospitality establishments are already working on many platforms to create awareness, market, and to book various business opportunities for hotels. However, there is also a lot to be done in-house as far as growing revenue and adding value. Front office has a unique chance to capture those untapped revenue streams as they interact with various guests, build rapport, and collect large amounts of information about the guest stay and his or her purpose in the city. In this lesson, you will learn about 1. Upselling and cross-selling at front office 2. How to increase revenue with correct room allocations and upgrades 3. Managing reservation to retain customers First, we will talk about upselling and cross-selling. Adding value is a term used to describe increasing the value of a product or service. We can recognize two ways of value adding in a hotel that occurs at the front desk. 1. Upselling 2. Cross-selling Upselling refers to persuading a customer to buy additional products and services, something that they didn't plan to buy initially. This is simply selling additional services or room upgrades to a guest that arrives at the hotel. The best time to start your upselling is during a check-in process. You can then offer your guest add-ons at a discounted rate to reward them for an early paid booking. A good opportunity also arises during an early arrival. If the room is not ready yet, you can offer a guest an upgraded option that they can check into straight away. Knowing your hotel and the PMS that it uses as well will allow you to navigate information efficiently and to gain insight on possible add-ons and upselling opportunities. Here are a few upselling techniques to be aware of. 1. Choice Reconfirmation Technique In this technique, you will inform the guest about an excellent choice they made by booking the hotel and the room. Reconfirm their choice and then you may mention possible add-ons that are currently available to book. 2. Incremental Quotation Technique This involves communicating the affordability of an upgrade. Start small by offering lowered price upgrades to a room instead of pushing for an upgrade that would result in a major price difference right away. 3. Special Request Technique a simple question like, do you have any special requests, may open a great opportunity to learn about the guest preference and any services or upgrades based on this that he or she might be willing to pay additional money for. But what are the things that we can upsell at front office? The list is long and depends on each establishment. But let us look at a few of the most common upselling products. One. Room upgrades. This is a classic option that often converts. This includes things like a higher room category, a room with a sea view, a room with a terrace or a garden, a bigger room, or adjoining rooms for families. 2. Packages. These are different room and amenity deals targeting different target customers such as breakfast or dinner package, a full board package, a package with tickets to a water park for a family, or a spa package. For example, during the COVID pandemic of 2020, Marriott introduced work from hotel packages to accommodate guests who need space to work remotely. Three, food and beverage. This includes adding on F&B related amenities. For example, a dinner for two add-on, cocktail hour, executive lounge access, and many more. Four, in-room extras. This includes adding in-room facilities to guest reservations such as chocolate-covered strawberries, extra housekeeping service, laundry services, and more. Another fantastic revenue-generating opportunity at the front desk is cross-selling. 
Hotels use cross-selling to persuade a guest to spend more money by purchasing a service or product related to what they already bought. You may think that cross-selling and upselling are the same thing. However, there's a subtle difference between them. Each one of the sale techniques is indicative of a specific phase in the buyer journey. Upselling can help you persuade a customer to spend more while or after they're choosing the product. Cross-selling is focused on getting customers to spend more after they book a room. The cross-selling offer has to relate to or complement the room or service that are already booked for. Examples would be 1. Extension of the guest stay. 2. Meeting room used with IT equipment for a meeting they are planning to have. 3. Underground car parking. 4. Tour and sightseeing that matches the guest interest. It would be relevant to note that some hotels may offer incentives to front office staff for upselling and cross-selling. This is additional motivation for employees to focus on driving revenue to the hotel.